are gonna start in a second position. So remember your ballet second position has the toes slightly pointed out. You're gonna squeeze your glutes. Navel is in towards your spine. And then we're gonna bend the knees and lower down in our plie. Knees are back. Make sure that you keep those knees back. At so you're gonna squeeze your booty there. And we're gonna lower down into our grand plie all the way up and then lower back down 20 times just like that. So up and lower, up and lower, good. So the arms have a nice circular motion. If you notice, they frame my face up at the top. And every time I lower down, you wanna resist on the way down. Good, lower and lift. This is a great warm up. So we're gonna be doing exercises in circuit. So we're gonna be doing a set of exercises. We'll do it once through together here. We'll take a little break and then we're gonna do them all over again, okay? So you're gonna really feel that burn. Here we go, 10 more, 10 and up. Nine, squeeze your glutes up at the top. Eight and seven, think of a long spine. Six, your back is nice and straight all the way up and down. Four and three and two and one. We're gonna hold here in our grand plie. So grand plie just means nice and deep and low. You're gonna lift up your heel. See if you can balance there. You can use your bar if you need to. Otherwise, see if you can balance and we're gonna pulse here 20 times. 20, whew, 19, 18, 17. You can always put those heels down if you need to. Pull the lower belly in. It's okay if you fall. Your body's just trying to find your balance. Get the uh, weight in the big toe. Beautiful. All right, I'm already starting to get breathless. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and come all the way up. Beautiful, beautiful job. Okay, so now we're gonna come into our bar here, and we're gonna find a fourth position. Okay, so fourth position is just, you find your first, you're gonna bring the foot forward, and you're gonna stay turned out. So you gotta use those glutes, all this external hip rotation, really good for hip mobility. We're gonna take a nice curtsy lunge. You're gonna develop hey, the leg, knee lifts up first, extend to the side, down and up. Beautiful, down and up. Good, so the hand is just resting on your bar and you're extending and lowering down. Curtsy and extend. Really nice. Good, so we're doing 20 here as well. And reach, good. 15 and reach. So you wanna have a nice even distribution between the legs as you go down into that curtsy position. So I really feel both of my legs working here. Lots of glutes, lots of hamstring work here. Hold on to that core. Good. You notice I'm starting to get a little breathless here. So we're gonna do 10 more like this. 10 and lower. Nine and lower. Eight, lower. And you don't have to hit the legs super high, just take it to your height. Seven and six. I love curtsy lunges because they really get into your booty. Nice. Four and three and two and one. Okay, we're gonna go to the other side. So I'm gonna actually take my chair. I'm gonna move it over here. And we're gonna do 20 here on the other side. Whew. I'm already feeling it. Feeling that good breath happening, right? I love that we're getting some cardio in. Still doing all of our low impact work. Here we go. 20 and 19, hold on to that core. 18, so what we would always say in ballet is when you lift the leg up, it's like you're presenting the heel. So you wanna reach the toes. I'm squeezing the standing glutes and you're presenting the bottom of your heel. Good, 14 and 13, beautiful. So you can take the curtsy lunge as low as you would like. It's up to you. 10 and nine. Notice my arm is just staying nice and soft. Seven and six, just floating along. Five, whew, four, so good. Three and two 
and one. Okay, so I'm gonna take my bar back over here. So my bar, yes, is my chair. And so remember, you wanna be using your hands on the bar to support your posture. So now we're gonna go into passe arabesque. So passe toe is right along the knee there. And then we're gonna go into arabesque and pull in. Now if this is too high, just lower it down a bit. Okay, so find your height and then you can work your way up higher. Here we go. And 20, 19, 18, 17, good. So again, I'm pushing into the bar with my hands. So I'm really pressing down and this helps to lift my chest up, right? So I'm not totally dropping my chest down. I'm staying pretty lifted here. Like you have a pretty necklace on that you're showing off and you're lifting up through the chest. Good, 10 more here, 10 and nine. Good, eight, seven, pull the lower belly in and five, you're doing good. Four, three, you're doing so good. Two, and one. Okay, shake that out. We're gonna go to the other side. So remember, you're starting in your first position. Squeeze the glutes, externally rotate the hips, pull the lower belly in. From there, place the hands on the bar, lift up to passe, extend to arabesque, point the toe, and pull it in. Here we go, 20, just like that. 19, 18, 17, 16. So I am tipping forward just a bit, but then I return back up to straight. So my head comes over my hips again. Nice, pull the lower belly in, use that core. You're engaging your quads as well. 10 more, 10 and nine, eight. Good, seven and six, feel the bird. Five, your muscles are getting so strong. Three, and two, and one. Nice work. Okay, we're gonna stay here at our bar. We're gonna come into a little demi-plie. My leg warmers are falling down. We're working so hard that I can't even stay up. Okay, we're gonna lower into our little demi-plie. Extend the left leg back and just quick lifts right there. Lower belly squeezes in, press into your bar and lift. Good. Again, two sets of 10 here. Five, four, three, two, another set of 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Lift the chest up, four, three, two, and one. Good, so let's come on to the other side, standing leg bends just slightly and pitch yourself forward just a little bit, but think of elongating through the spine. Here we go. Two sets of 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Again, 10. Make sure that the knee is tracking over your toes. Okay, so the knee isn't falling inward. Good, last five, four, three, two, one, and take a little breather. Okay, we're gonna move into our next exercise. Coming now down to the floor. Hands are gonna come to the floor. We're gonna work a little bit on our core, our abs, and our arms. So we're gonna come into a high plank pose. Good, find your high plank. If high plank is too much for you, you can do the same thing on your elbows here, just like that. Okay, otherwise, hands, we're gonna lift one leg up at a time. Pull the lower belly in, and we're doing 20 leg lifts here. Make sure that the booty stays down, okay? Try not to get, let your bottom go all the way up here. Stay here in the nice straight plank pose. Here we go, 20, 19, 18, 17. So every time I'm pointing my toes, I'm elongating through my spine, I'm even reaching through my chest, good. Feel the glutes work, feel the hamstrings work, feel the abs work, feel the arms work, shoulders, it's really totally full body right here. And five, four, and three, and two, and one, and come on down. Okay, are you sweating yet? I am sweating, and it takes a lot for me to sweat, so I know you've gotta be 
working hard at home. Okay, so we've got a, a cool combo here. We're gonna be going up, lifting all the way up, and then lowering down, and then lift the leg up towards the hand like this. So my legs stay straight, I'm engaging my quad. It's gonna be a lot of quad and inner thigh. Point the toe, nice long, beautiful ballet lines here, okay? And I just sweep the arm up and over, my hips lift up, and I lower down, lift and lower. All right, let's start with 10 right here. And 10, and up, good. Nine, and up. It really does take so much effort to just lift our own body weight. Okay, so make this fluid, make this smooth. That's where the challenge comes in. The more resistance you have in your body like that, the more challenging it's actually going to be, right? The muscles have to work harder. You have to recruit more muscles to move slow. So that arm is getting a ton of work there. Good. Five more, five. And up. Whew. That leg's getting tired. Four. And up. Good. Three. And up. And two. And up. And one. Make that arm nice and pretty. And up. Good. Now we're just going to lower and lift the leg right here for 10. And nine. If you need to lower down to the elbow, you can do that as well. Eight. You'll get a little more range of motion. Seven. Six. Five. The toe is turned out. Four. Three. Two. And one. Nice. We're going to lift all the way back up into that position we were just at. Now see if you can now just lift the top leg up into a passe. Hold here. Lift up higher. Hold for 10. Nine. Eight. Seven. You've got this. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. All right. Let's switch sides here now. So same thing here. We're going to lift Sweep the arms up and over, lower down, lift and touch the toes, just like that. Here we go. And up, we're doing 10, Whew. nine, nice, slow breathing, moving gracefully within your body, feeling connected to your body. Really allowing yourself to just connect and be present in your body. So many times we're so all over the place in our minds and we're not even in our body, right? We kind of have these out of body experiences. So this is a time to ground and root and feel just amazing in your body. Three, two more, two and up and one and up nice so let's take the leg lift so you can lower down onto your elbow ten and nine eight point the toe engage the quad seven and six five four three two and one good now we're going to lift all the way up see if you can then press into the edge of the heel or the left foot and come all the way up into a passe. Hold here, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, come down. Okay, we've got one last exercise, and then we're gonna repeat all of those exercises one more time, okay? Are you feeling this? I bet you are. Okay, so we're gonna come up into a bridge. So first start by Squeezing the glutes underneath you, rolling up. Make sure that you're not pushing through the low back, okay? Really squeeze the glutes. You may need to even lower the hips a little bit down. That's okay. We're gonna extend one leg up, and we're just gonna press into that bottom heel, and we're gonna lift and lift. Squeeze the shoulder blades together, press the palms down. Here we go. Two sets of 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, another set of 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Stay up there. Switch sides. Let's go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. You've got this last set of ten. 
nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and come down. Okay, I've got one little bonus exercise for you here before we go into our second circuit. We're gonna come into our first position, squeeze everything together, lower belly in, and we're just gonna lift up onto our toes. Calf raises, two sets of 10. You ready? All right, let's go, and 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. All right, shake it out. Take a sip of water if you need to. We're gonna do all those exercises one more time, okay? You did an amazing job, and now it's time to take it up a notch. So let's take a quick stretch here. We can stretch with our bar as we rest. This will be a nice little active recovery. So my legs are wide. I'm just gonna take a nice forward fold over the legs and then reach all the way back up. Nice job. And then we're gonna reach towards the bar and then let's stretch away from the bar. Beautiful. Let's take our legs into a first position. Forward fold here over the legs. Nice work. Reach forward. A little stretch to this side as we mentally prepare ourselves to do it again. But you are so strong. You've got this. Here we go. We're gonna start in our second position. This time we're gonna add a little releve. So last time we just did here to straight. Now we're gonna add a releve all the way up onto the toes. Okay, working those calves. I know you guys love my calf workout, so I know you're gonna like this one. Here we go. And two sets of 10. And nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, squeeze that booty up at the top, two, and one. Another set of 10, here we go. 10, and nine. Have those arms nice and light, just floating through the air. Six, use that core. Five, this is where all the power is coming from. Four, three, and two, and one. Stay up onto those toes. We're gonna lower into our plie on our toes. Here we go, pulse down, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, another set of 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, whoo, three, two, one. Nice job, okay. So now we're gonna do our curtsy to developpe side. So again, just start in that first position, place the hand on the bar, just extend the leg back behind you, curtsy down, weight is evenly in both legs. Here we go, and 10, two sets of 10. I like to take it in chunks of 10, just helps my brain better. Eight, and seven, make sure you have a good distance. Kind of scooted my bar out because I felt like I was a little cramped. So you want to feel open, good. Five, whew, four, this one really gets the heart rate up. Three, two, and one. Keep the elbow lifted. Another set of 10, so no droopy elbows like this. Right, it looks like a wilted flower. So get that elbow lifted. Nice presence. Keep the chest high. Keep showing off that necklace there. Whew. Seven. And you can take the leg lower if you need to. Six, five, and four. So on the second round, this is where you get to really perfect your technique. Three, and two, present the heel, and one. Okay, let's go to the other side. That one really, really wins me. I get winded. I don't know if wins me is a <laughs> phrase. Okay. Hand on the bar, find your curtsy lunge right here, and open, 20, and 19, 18, whew, 17, 16, 15. So be intentional with your movements, 14, right? I really present, and I know exactly where I'm putting my foot out in the air, right? It looks very intentional. 
lots of purpose. And another set of 10. And same thing with the arm, nine. The arm, if you notice, never stops moving. Eight, it has a fluid motion, right? If you were in water, nothing ever stops, right? It's continuous movement. Six, whew, five, and four, three, oh boy, two, and one, and take a little breather, wow. All right, I hope you're loving this as much as I do. There's something about moving in this feminine, beautiful, graceful way. It's so strong in a very graceful way. Okay, so let's start in our first position. Squeeze the booty, lift up the quads, pull up through the front of the belly, pull up through the chest, lift up to the top of the head. Nice, place the hands on the bar. Now just lift the leg up to your passe, and here we go, arabesque right here for 10, and nine, and eight, seven. You're doing okay? You're doing awesome. The fact that you're here right now, working on your body, connecting, taking care of yourself, just says so much about you and who you are. Two, and one. Another set of 10, 10, and nine. Eight, think about your posture. Seven, six, lower belly squeezes in. Five, and four, good. Three, two, and one. Okay, so there's so many parts of these moves that every time you do this, there's a new little thing you can focus on. Let's go to the other side. So right here, you can start to focus on your chest and your back. Okay, so how is my chest? How is my back? How are my shoulder blades? Where is my head, right? You don't wanna be sticking your chin up like that. The chin stays pretty level the whole time. And then how's your foot doing out there? Are you pointing it? Are you engaging your quad? Are you extending through the leg? Nice, one more set of 10 right here. 10 and nine, Whew. eight. You're doing awesome, seven, six, this is not easy stuff. Five, four, three, but this is gonna get you so strong. Two, and one, nice. So use that bar, push out of it. Okay, let's go to the other side. We're gonna start in our demi play in our first position. Extend the leg back in tendu, lower belly squeezes in. Big batma lift, up, and 10, nine, eight, Seven, six, push into the bar. Five, four, three, two, one more set of 10 right here. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, let's go to the other side. Oh my God, my legs are starting to feel like jelly. Bend the legs, extend the leg back. Here we go. But I love this because it's truly full body here as we work on our legs, inner thighs, hamstrings, glutes, back, abs, arms, everything. Good. Another set of 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Okay. We are moving it now down to the floor. And I am pretty sweaty here. Here we go, right away. Lift on up, reach, and up. Good, nine, and up, eight, up, seven, and up. Good, six, whew, five, four, you've got this, three, and up, and two, and up, and one. Good, let's lower onto that elbow, lift it up 10 times, use that inner thigh, turned out, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and 
one. Now we're gonna come back up to the hand, lift all the way up, see if you can find that passe. Woo. Lift the hips up, squeeze the bottom glute. Use your core, you've got this. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, let's go to the other side. I am sweating, I love it. I know most people think, oh, ballets, so easy. Oops, I forgot the leg, here we go, up and lift. But it's really, really, really hard, right? Eight, this is why I love working with just body weight. Just learning how to lift your own muscles, you can truly transform your body. You do not lift, need to lift heavy iron, pump in the gym. This is how I love and prefer to work out. No injuries, right? You're always in total control. Five, nice, four, and up, and three, Whew. and two, and one, and lift. Nice, let's lower down onto the elbow. Turn the foot out, externally rotate, and here we go, 10, nine, eight, seven, make sure you're lifting up through the chest, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Let's come all the way up and lift, high up onto the side, lift this side hip, find your passe right here. The toe is pointed, hold for 10, nine, eight, soften the shoulders, five, four, three, lift up higher, two, one, Lower down, okay. I didn't get forget about our abs. I went out of order a little bit, but let's do them right here. This time, let's lower onto our elbows. Extend long, good. Now, we're just gonna tap this time out to the side, back to the center. Okay, 20 times, pull those abs in. Shoulders are over your elbows. Make sure they're not far forward. Right there in the middle, tuck the pelvis under, squeeze the belly in, and let's go, 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one more set of 10 right here. 10, you've got this. Nine, eight, stay strong. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good. All right, flip on over for our bridge. So you wanna have your feet right about to where your fingertips are. Bring the feet all the way together. Tuck the pelvis under, roll on up. This time we're just gonna lower the leg down and up. Okay, down and up. So it's gonna flex down, point up. Here we go. 10, up, nine, up, eight, and seven, six. Squeeze the shoulder blades. Press the palms into the ground. Three and two and one. Keep those hips up high, don't let them drop. 10, I know, bridges are so challenging. It's crazy, it's good. I'm always like so amazed of how hard it is. Good, five, four, three and two and one. Good, switch the sides, don't come down. Retuck that pelvis. Squeeze the shoulder blades underneath you, palms down, and let's go. 10 and nine, we're almost there. We've got this exercise, and then we've got our calf raises, and then that's it. You are all done. I love that we get to repeat the exercises because then you can really work on your form. You can see how you get stronger each and every time. Good, 10 and nine. Eight, seven, good, six, five, four, three, two, so close, one, and come out of it. Okay, so this is it. We've got our calf raises, finale right here, final move. I lift my leg warmers up. Okay, squeeze everything together. Squeeze the glutes together, lift up through the belly, and let's go. Up for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Again, 10, 
nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Something inside me is saying you want to do those again. I know, I'm giving you a little extra bonus. Let's do it again. Soft arms, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Remember those arms are in water. Nine, eight, seven, six. This is it, five, four, three, two, one. Let's hold balance here. Squeeze the booty, lift up through the spine. Put the weight in the big toes. Round and frame your face. Sound like someone's making, taking a photo of you right here. This would be that perfect sweaty selfie moment. And lower it down. Beautiful, beautiful work. Let's take a quick stretch to cool down. Inhale in, exhale forward fold. You did an amazing job. And then reach all the way up. Take a nice little side bend here. So, so proud of you for your work today. You crushed that workout, and I hope you're feeling so strong in your body right now. Make sure that you like this video. It really helps out my channel. And subscribe so that you don't miss a single workout from me. All right, love you so much. See you in the next workout. Bye.